Hello everyone and welcome back to Terraria 1.3 Hard Mode. Um, as you can see, I've been doing some redecorating again. In fact, I've changed a lot of things. Uh, some of them are maybe less noticeable. Um, but I decided to spruce things up, uh, use some more different blocks and experiment a little with the, with some different walls and different things. So uh, this room has actually been changed a little. Um, the uh, uh, I think the top row here has been moved down a little, um, and and in this room I've aligned the uh, the platforms with the platforms in there in the treasure room, uh, and I made room for down here for maybe even more just treasure room. I don't know, uh, and I don't know why I have these. <laughs> These uh, blocks stuck to the <laughs> yeah. These these are not supposed to be here. Just uh, pretend you didn't see those. There we go. Uh, oh, in fact, uh, as you can see, I'm experimenting with all kinds of backgrounds here. So uh, over here, I've uh, made a museum of statues. So uh, right now, I have all my statues over here, uh, and I think that looks pretty good. Uh, Oop, maybe I need a platform up here. Uh, mm. So that's uh, it was becoming very crowded up here, uh, and I changed, as I said, these platforms uh, to align with those in the uh, in the treasure room, uh, and made a little more room here because who knows, maybe I uh, I will get some more uh, plaques or something I want to put up here. Also, the uh, banners were getting very crowded down here. I'm not sure I'm loving the uh, the uh, big just having them as a big curtain here, but uh, mm, it's it's gonna do for now. <laughs> it's gonna be the way it is. Um, but I really wanted to like, uh, and I'm also moved. Uh, I also moved all my uh, crafting benches, uh, my furnace, my anvil, and such down here, so they're no longer up here. I, like I said, I really wanted to uh, clean up uh, the the area up here, so there's much less stuff cluttering. Uh, there's still some banners hanging around here uh, that I might as well take down. They belong down there, maybe, or something. I don't know. I'm gonna keep experimenting uh, because I wanted to look uh, snazzy and amazing down here. So. Um, Anyway, so these uh, mechanical bosses, we uh, managed to beat the destroyer, uh, but I'm still having trouble with the uh, with the other two. Um, and I fought the uh, the skeleton prime boss, uh, and remember. Uh, if you go a few videos back, you'll see me fighting Skeleton Prime, and I'm doing kind of okay. I'm running around, I'm dodging him, and uh, uh, and then at the very end, he just goes in and one-shots me with 932 damage or something. And I find that, or I found that very frustrating. And I had another fight with him, uh, uh, short, <laughs> very shortly uh, before this, and. Um, and once again I was dodging around and I thought maybe I had better stuff now or something. Um, and I used my uh, Angry Nimbus Cloud. It's not super effective against him, but uh, everything helps. And, and the Angry Nimbus uh, is just like a fire and, and forget, right? You just put it and it just stays there. And every raindrop that hits a mob just does damage, so that's fine. Uh, and I think I was doing okay. And then once again, uh, as you can see uh, from from this here clip, uh, I once again get one shotted, and like <laughs> that's it, uh, the end. So I reviewed my uh, like my own recording, and I thought, what are you doing wrong, Sneaky? Why? Why? And I got to thinking that maybe uh, what's wrong is I'm focusing too much on dodging his attacks, running around, avoiding damage, um, and I'm not doing enough damage. Because, because, 
<laughs> Here it comes. Um, because uh, I got the idea that maybe he was not supposed to like one shot you. Unless, unless it took you so long to defeat him that it actually turned day. And I looked it up and it's... <laughs> that is the case. If it if, if it takes you so long that it, it becomes morning, he goes into his uh, killer uh, mode, where he'll uh, keep spinning, he'll do double damage, and he'll just uh, run you over and usually one shot you. It says so. <laughs> so I figured that's what happened. That I simply took too long. So I did another. Oh, the merchant has arrived. So I did another attempt, uh, and this time I uh, went in his face, so to speak. Uh, well, literally, actually, because I stopped trying to, like, wheel down the arms, and I just tried to go straight for the head. Of course, uh, since I'm using uh, I'm using uh, my uh, Mega Shark with the crystal bullets, and the crystal bullets actually explode and such, I do hit the arms a lot, uh, um, and... Um, I also do a lot of damage to them. But why don't I stop talking and I'll show you how it went when I did my new strategy. I start off by drinking my uh, potions of course, uh, iron skin and regeneration. And I've deployed my uh, Nimbus Cloud again. Um, this time I try to stay on my platform uh, in the last battle, uh, you couldn't see that, but in the last battle I was running around in my house and such. Uh, stay off the ground when you're fighting the Skeleton Prime, because uh, he throws uh, bombs, you'll see them uh, time uh, dropping, and they don't actually explode unless they hit solid ground, so they'll just go right through these, uh, these platforms. Like, one there um, and do no damage to you they don't do any damage to blocks either so, so that's like one of his weapons uh, that you don't have to worry about then. I was using my uh, banana ring here uh, in the beginning of the fight Range uh, is an issue with uh, the banana ring, uh, I think. So I switched to um, my Mega Shark, and uh, that seems to be uh, a bit more effective. <laughs> Being a potion, staying, uh, I'm doing very well with health, but I did so in the other fights as well. So. I said I'm aiming for the head mostly, but I do also hit the arms sometimes. Uh, they're in the way. <laughs> and the arms are beginning to look uh, very damaged. Uh, I move from side to side, uh, that way you can uh, keep your aim on him, and then sometimes I, uh, I sort of circle around him, uh, try to keep, uh, keep firing. At this point I was uh, beginning to think that uh, maybe I would succeed. Maybe this would be the one. 
killed me so many times that uh, I killed him prime. But uh, so the arms are looking very weak now. at him even though I can't see him sometimes. Come on. Uh, look at the damage he's taking there. Now he's outside my view again. And there he goes. Hooray! Oh, skeleton prime. Defeated. Yay! There you go, in your face, Skeleton Prime. And I'm, uh, I'm, I'm wearing my Skeleton Prime mask now. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, sorry, <laughs> that was a bird there. Um, yeah, so I finally managed to defeat him. Wow. But I guess it was all about having the uh, the right strategy and the right preparations. So, uh, in conclusion, stay off the ground. Don't be afraid to get in there and and hit him. And uh, I don't know if you have to have a ranged weapon, but uh, it certainly seemed like the uh, the Mega Shark was uh, doing its business there. Uh, so um, that means uh, I don't think we have that much time left uh, <laughs> of this episode. We spend it all on fighting, fighting the big mobs. to make a shock for you. I'm thinking about what to put down here. I don't know. Should it just be over here? It could be treasure room, but I could make something else here. And as you can see, I already dug out uh, below here uh, because I'm, I want to make it bigger. And besides, I think I'm going to fill this uh, statue thing up. So I probably need an extra floor for that as well. Um, so the, the actual floor is going to be at this height and this down here it's gonna go I have to go but um, yeah I'm gonna do some more building uh, off camera oh a really silly thing that, uh, that I found out uh, that found out a while ago actually but uh, was when I was putting in the window so it was some time ago let me just see if I can uh, show you um i need i need why did i put all my stuffs i had all my stuffs here yeah, but i emptied out my inventory for um, um well i guess we can show you with this copper plating wall which i haven't quite decided what to do with yet i just like the way it looks it's the uh, one i got down here but uh back in the in the beginning i would uh, take my yeah. hammer uh and I would, uh, I would take down the uh, background wall and then I would put up the new one. <laughs> Which is super silly because you can just put it and it'll replace the wall. Yeah, you guys probably knew that already. Uh, but in case you were as silly as I was, uh, for a long time uh, I kind of did everything double here. Yeah. Uh, but when I made the windows uh, back in the day, I, I realized that... Uh, you didn't have to. <laughs> so, anyway, if you have any uh, comments or suggestions, as always, you can leave them below. And if you feel like uh, pressing the uh, subscribe or the like button, it's uh, greatly appreciated. 
and I'll see you again next time. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna be uh, the twins. I don't promise. I think maybe we'll be do something else, but I don't know. We'll see you next time on Terraria Hard Mode 1.3. Yeah. Bye.